Today I'm making a quick video talking about how to add refrigerant oil to a AC component after you replace it. I just put this AC compressor on this BMW and um, I'm, un I'm unsure of the uh, history of this as far as how it's been serviced in the past. He said he had a um, AC leak and it's been in another shop and they've been adding Freon and you know doing evac and recharges on it and um, yeah I'm just talking about when you're adding oil to something like this. Here's the old AC compressor, and what they want you to do is um, drain the um, drain the refrigerant oil into a container, measure how much comes out of the old one, and add that quantity to the new one, which would work perfectly fine in a um, in a perfect world if the thing never had a leak, or and it was always charged correctly, and the right amount of oil was added back after an evac and recharge, and the um, and it never went to a body shop, let's say, and the condenser was damaged and they didn't add oil. Everything was done perfect, that would be the way to do it. But um, a lot of times with unknown history, you'll drain it out and there won't be enough in your AC compressor for the system to uh, be healthy you know, and work correctly. So a quick way to do it that, um, that, that'll get you close to right is um, that's what I'll show you over here. So you find the system's capacity for refrigerant oil, um, like this particular car is, uh, is around 110 cc's of uh, peg oil and then down here um, every car is roughly the same as this this is pretty pretty good guidelines the ac compressor holds 50 percent of the capacity so about 60 cc's it should be roughly what's stored in the ac compressor with the car off the condenser holds 10 percent so 10 percent of the total volume so these numbers will get you close if you replace a section a suction hose you put you know 10 percent of the system capacity in it the evaporator 20 percent um, and this just gives you rough guidelines so if you're replacing the AC compressor and the car was in a front end collision and the and you know a lot of crazy things happened or it was worked at, you know, it doesn't wasn't done correctly, someone kept you know the AC let's say the AC compressor was covered in oil from just leaking over years and the system was pretty dry, you'd want to minimally add fifty percent of the full capacity to your AC compressor when you when you change that out. So just kind of rough guidelines about how to uh, get it close to correct. Thanks for watching.